it was actually the press, the tabloid press, that labelled it a second honeymoon. It was far <laughs> from that. It really was about going away, taking the boys away. Uh, it was important and important that they were seen as a family doing the right thing. And the friends were there just as a sort of a buffer so that those two didn't actually have to be alone in each other's company 24-7. The friends were there as a backup. So were things that bad between them at that time that they couldn't be alone together without there being some kind of conflict? The thing, things were pretty bad. Um, the, the, the marriage, I think, started deteriorating. It started deteriorating after William was born and really accelerated after Harry was born. Diana suffered from uh, postnatal depression. And what man in the 1980s understood it?